Right, my people, we are back at it again with another toy review starring the magnificent Anakin Skywalker. Uh, this time, it is uh, the Spawn Alley uh, play sets. Now, this one was in my big uh, toy spawn hall if you guys didn't see my those videos uh had three of them part one part two and part three um if you didn't watch them check them out please anakin is is very excited for this review as you can tell and uh you know what i i said i was going to sell this one i didn't really like it because spawn is very very tiny as you can see here's my thumb there is Spawn. But, you know, that Violator looks pretty interesting. And some of the background pieces look pretty interesting. And you know what? I I am curious to tear this baby open because I just want to see what's going on with this thing. You know, I, I know I'm not going to like the Spawn because he has such a tiny head. Violator, I might like the little baby Violator. He looks pretty interesting. Um, so yeah, I'm going to tear this baby open. This is the other play sets, uh, which I'm probably not going to get. It, it would have been nice if they made the play sets like the figures, uh, six, six inch figures or seven inch figures. This guy is maybe, I don't know, three, four inch figure, maybe, maybe not even that. And here's the rest of, uh, all of this, of course, from 1997. Because that's when the Spawn movie came out. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to open this up. Maybe uh, it will change my mind. There's the Spawn. On the side. Right there. Well, that's about it. Nothing much to it. We're going to break it open together. We're going to experience this. We're going to experience this together. Are you excited? Are you excited? No. Okay, out the way, out the way. Let me put my weight right here. Put this right here so you guys can watch me open this box of either disappointment or box of joy. It's always fun opening these packages. Uh, until you actually hold it in your hand. Then it's kind of like, uh, it's 50-50. All right, here's a Spawn Alley. Wow. Wow. This thing is... Is... Wow. Let me bring this in for you guys right here. So you guys can see it. Don't ask me what that says. Oh, Spankaroo. <laughs> I get it. Spankaroo. Yeah, that's, that's funny. Kiss... TCZ, somebody's initials, could have meaning, could not have meaning. Maybe the designer of the set, maybe TZ, T TCZ. And that one right there, don't ask me, I don't know what that means. Spankaroo. Spankaroo, I've never said that word in my entire life until now. I hope that's not somebody's name or somebody's nickname. But uh, I definitely will use it during sex. Next time I have sex. There you go. A little bit uh, too much information for you guys, but being that I never used this word before, we're going to use it. And I'm going to use it during sex. I know. I, that, that sounds creepy. I apologize. But anyways, I'm going to get to his accessories later. Um, and we're going to get to straight to the toys, because I'm interested in see what these toys are all about. Alright, so let's start with the Violator first, because he looks cool. Um, yeah, very small looking Violator. I mean, he's not bad looking. I mean, he, with Violator's uh, sculpture, I mean, you can't really go wrong. I don't think I've ever seen a bad Violator. I mean, let me put this down right here. You guys can watch that. 
move his arm. Hopefully, don't break on me. You know what? I'm not hating. Does his jaw move? No, his jaw doesn't move. He's just uh, a piece of plastic. His legs move. You know what? I actually like this one. I like this violator, even though he has very to little no articulation. Let me bring this in for you guys. He's pretty pretty decent looking figure, you know. His arms move, he's got elbow bends, knees don't bend, waist, no, nothing there. He's got pegs in the back though. Oh no, those are his spikes, never mind. Uh, no bend at the knee, no bend at the ankle, but he moves. His legs move, so that's a plus. That's my cat messing around with spawn toys. He loves spawn. He's a big spawn fan. You know what? You know what? I like this uh, violator. I kind of like the background. I'm definitely going to use the background. Um, yeah, I definitely will keep the background. So, now let's look at Spawn himself. Or should I call him Baby Spawn? Okay. Alright. Well, there's nothing much to Spawn. You know, I reviewed uh, the movie Spawn uh, the other day. And I was complaining that how hideous his face looked. Um, my last review that I did, the uh, Unmasked Spawn. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you guys see that? I'm trying to get it to focus, but there ain't, there's nothing much to see. I wish I had the masked version of the movie Spawn. Um, I mean, he's not a bad character, you know. Um, no articulation other than arms move up and down. His chains, can you see that? Why is my camera not focusing? His chains are uh, attached to his body. Mm. You know what? I'm not hating. Let's put him right here. I mean, there you go. I really don't know what to say. Let's check out his accessories. I mean, it's not bad. It actually looked bad in the box, but you know what? It's not bad. Any? Let me see here. It comes with the garbage can. There's the garbage can right there. You guys can see that. And, oh, he has a gun. Look at that. Spawn. Baby Spawn has a gun. Now I can get this out of what we you guys hanging. So, you guys watch me take this, try to take this gun out. You know what? This gun actually looks better than the gun that the uh, regular size movie Spawn had. Let me see. And he can actually hold it. Look at that. You know what? I'm not hating. That's a pretty big gun, though. I'm not hating on this movie spawn. I'm trying to get you guys uh, to see the face, but for some reason it's not zooming. All right. And it comes with, let's see, a tire. At least I think it's a tire. It kind of looks like a, a Reese's cup. Actually, I don't know what the hell it is. I think it's a tire. And then the next one is these two, I guess, wooden boards, broken wooden boards. Where do they go? I do not know. Oh, they even have peg peg stands. Look at that. They have pegs. If I put right here. At least I think. Yeah. Uh, he's not pegging though. Hmm. I don't know. Does it matter? Does he have pegs? No. Spawn, baby spawn, doesn't have pegs. 
Well, yeah, there you go, guys. I mean, out of the box, out of the box, it actually they actually look pretty good. Um, and you know what? I might keep the set. Uh, like I said, in in the box, you know, it gives you uh, a different perspective. You know, um, when you take them out the box, you know, it's just you you have different perspective a perspective on them. And you know what? I actually like. I'm actually going to keep the Spawn Alley set. I actually like them now that I got them out the box. And my cat likes them too, as you can see. He likes the spike. Oh my god, he loves the spike. Any? Oh, he loves the violator because he's a little violator himself. All right, guys. Well, there is my review. This has a piece of tape on it. I'll take this piece of tape off so you guys can see. It's just kind of holding the doors together. I might as well let you guys see that. Because I always end up finding something new after I get finished doing the video. I'm like, oh, damn it. Damn it. Yeah, and that breaks open right there. I guess for spawn the bust in or violating the bust in. There he goes. Yeah, I mean it's a cool playset. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't like it. I was going to sell it. I'm glad I opened it. And you know what? I like it. I actually like it. It'll be a nice display, a nice display piece. So yeah, there you guys go. Mini garbage can, mini Reese's cup, broken boards. That's what it comes with. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. In the box, I gave it probably about a two. Looking at it now, I give it probably about... I'll give it a seven. You know? I'll give it a seven. It's worthy of a seven. It's not as bad as, as it looked in the box. It actually... It's pretty cool holding it in your hands. That's amazing what action figures can do when you're actually holding it in your hands. As opposed to looking at, at it in the box and like, uh, I don't know. Well, anyways, guys, that's my review of the uh, Spawn Alley playset from the Spawn movie, 1997 Spawn movie. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. Please check out my further reviews if you want to check out further reviews of uh, upcoming toys, not only Spawn figures, but other toys that I will be reviewing. Uh, please subscribe. Please like. You can follow me on Instagram, Flipagram under the same name. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll check you guys later next time. Bye-bye. Bye, Spawn.